Is that the word live? Yeah. What is <laughs> up with it? Welcome to the Scar and Tove Show. The first Scar and Tove Show in quite some time. Something Scar has said at the start of every episode, but is actually true today, which... So, I don't I don't know what it's like to have it be the Scar and Tove Show and call some... Have somebody call it the Tofen Scar Show. I just welcome to the Tofen Scar Show. I know. I just experienced that for, for the first time because. How did that feel? I did the thing. It feels you, horrible. Right. It's false. What's his name from Smash GG? Sean. Sean. Insisted on calling it the Tofen Scar Show seven thousand times. Uh, so. Because he knows. No, it's because he knows. He's been following. You know. He, he's he's tuned in. He's dug into the pulse of the. Uh, you know. I didn't feel good about it, and so from now on, I'm going to respect the Scar and Tove's Tove and Scar, uh, just dynamic. The the winner. I'm gonna very the protocol. Much the protocol. You're gonna respect the protocol. Yeah, that's good. No, I am but too. Today, I am too because today is the Scar and Tove show. Scar defeated me in a in a best of five set at the end of the last episode. Really? He did. Falcon versus Fox. He said he was back, and he proved it. Let's skill, skill, integrity, <laughs> show decision them, making. Show them your shirt. Before that, welcome to the Scar and Tove show. <laughs> no, you, no, you did, you did that. S fat. No, I didn't. Okay. S fat. Oh yeah. Hey guys. Hey. What's up? Thanks this for having S-Fat. me. Thanks. Thanks Likewise. For, uh, inviting me on. It's been a bit of a chaotic evening, but I mean, <laughs> yes. to be honest, I'm gonna, I'm gonna hit, I'm gonna hit the people with the cold hard truth. Uh... I don't think we started on time once. The kinks are being sorted we're not out. Not so bad today. Actually, no. 20, 20 given minutes. how given how chaotic things are, we're starting pretty good because we we've we've started at like eight before, and that was with Spencer Spencer finagling stuff last minute. So I mean, you know, it is what it is. It is what it is. For the people coming in, maybe you just tuned in. Maybe you're watching the vod on YouTube or Twitch, and you're thinking, why is the audio and video quality a little lower than normal? That is because Spencer is doing foundry stuff this evening, and that is because. This week is Labor Day week, which means, you know, we're, things are thrown off, but we will be back to the usual, you know, every Monday schedule soon. Things are getting sorted out. Oh, so you guys mess up on my my show, the one that I come Tope on. We account, for, we account for the most adaptable guests through the performance <laughs> we see in their videos. What we know about them as people, about them as good, you know, Tope good natured human beings. If it was up to me, I would have Nick M. Whittier on the show today. <laughs> Just just because of how chaotic it's been today. Correct. Just feels like an NMW show. You know, you can talk about team's commentary. Yeah, like NMW. I can zone out 100%, not listen to a word that he says. And he could teach you a thing or two uh, about Captain Falcon. I would not hear that either. So, I talk to Gravy. But instead, we are anyway. here with S Fat Zach Cordoni, a perennial top player. Top three in NorCal for yeah. years well, and years. It's been it's been a few years, I suppose. Top two, actually. Top this, two? This season. Yeah. But, uh, the, uh, I remember, I remember back in, so I mean, one thing I do want to talk about on this episode, of course, I mean, I think you've got a lot of history in NorCal. Uh, only 21 years, but. Only 21 years. But, I remember, uh, I remember when I, when I first came to, uh, when I first came to NorCal, in fact, before I came to NorCal, when I came for Genesis 2 and I visited, mm. and uh, you showed me around it. You took me to San Mateo. <laughs> you took me to Quick Lease. I was there with... This is when you were housing Fuzziness. Yes. If you remember, no, if you think back, 2011. Uh, no, no, no. no. I, I housed Fuzziness in Genesis 1. Oh, God. This was Genesis 1, then. This was Genesis, Genesis 1. Genesis 1. So we're going all the way back. We're going back to Genesis 1. <laughs> and there are the... Our... I don't know what the word is. The, per- the first person in the name likes to, likes to, you know, the old days. And so we were driving around, and, you know, you told me, you were like, you know. Someone NorCal. bring up Genesis 1? No. Are we talking about Genesis 1 right now? We were, we were, going, to, we were going to Bubble Tier. We are going to talk about teams Bubba. on this episode. We talk, want to talk about teams in Genesis 1? Anybody know? I, I'm actually down to talk about teams in Genesis 1. <laughs> but no, so we were driving around, and you were saying how, you, be, you I remember you told me, you were like, you know, NorCal, you said, you know, a lot of people in NorCal are really, really chill. Uh, me and, however, there are two people in NorCal that are really competitive. You said me and Dewan. You uh-huh. said me and Shroom are really competitive. And, you know, at the end of the day, we're all family. It's all love. But me and Shroom are, are the most competitive out of the people here. Yeah. yeah. And, uh... We've had that rivalry for a few years. It's been a while. It's 
been uh, almost six years, I want to say. Six years? Jeez. What, it's 2015, so... Yeah. yeah, 2009 was Genesis 1, right? Yep. So yeah, before, probably a year and a half before Genesis 1 is when Dewan and I really started going at it. And he was all Doc. Yeah, at that point. All Doc. Uh, You're the reason. I remember beating Dewan's ass in Genesis 1. <laughs> in tournament? In a money match. Oh, shit. With all of NorCal watching, Peter said I wouldn't make it out of pools. Peter did say that. Peter did, no, Peter did the say that. The whole West Coast had to, uh, had to hold that L. <laughs> Including Dewan. Where I remember I like up threw him at uh, 40 and I up aired him like six times to do a knee. <laughs> wow. Everybody was like, come on. <laughs> DI, dude. <laughs> and I was like, this guy sucks. Like, that just happened last week when Jeff called with him and then he gets hit by it again. Go on. Go on. We're going to have to get him on at some point. But, uh, <laughs> yeah. Um, the, the, the interesting thing I remember from back then was that I feel like, so you and, I mean, you, you came into Smash. Back then, I mean, you've, you've been friends with Kevin, with people you, for a really long time. Yeah. But I remember, I think, I feel like back then, like, he wasn't, he didn't take, maybe he didn't take singles as seriously, or I don't know what the deal was, but, you know, it wasn't, like, I feel like he didn't really come out. I remember he didn't even win his first tournament until, like, 2013. Uh, actually. 13? It, it might have been 12 or... I remember one of those Game Center tournaments after we came to, after we started open, you know, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, what, Myung started hosting him. And this was after I moved to NorCal, and I remember Kevin won a tournament. And he said that that was actually the first singles tournament I actually won. Like, you know, like he'd yeah. done second or whatever, but he hadn't won a NorCal singles tournament. Yeah, he'd, he had always been uh, kind of held back by his parents. Parents not wanting him to go and compete as much as my parents. And and then, you know, once he got into college or his later high school years, he started coming to more tournaments. And he was always, he was always that good. He just never had the chance to kind of prove himself. Mm -hmm. So... And what, so, at what point, because, you know, at what point did you sort of start being considered, like, a top NorCal player? Because I feel like the, the dynamic we have now in NorCal with, like, you, Shroomed, and Kevin, mm -hmm. you, Delon, and Kevin is, like, the top three. I feel like that took a while to kind of settle in, because back in the day, it was, like, it was all Jeff, and it was all, like, the old school guys. Yeah, it was DDR Jeff, at first. Sue, Lunin, Before that, Isaiah, you know? Yeah, King, but, King yeah. Um, I guess... Uh, after Genesis 2, for sure, um, I don't know, I, I, I'd have to look at the power rankings when, when we started getting ranked, but I think, you know, because Kevin jumped from not ranked to number 4 instantly, mm -hmm. um, and I think the trifecta started taking over around, like, 2012, or maybe 13? After Genesis 2. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, 2012, I think, and then the, we've just kind of been on top since. No one's really, uh, I don't think anyone has taken a set from all three of us. People have taken sets from two of the three, but mm -hmm. not, not all three. What are you talking about? What? what? Like, ever? Yeah, yeah. In NorCal, in Nor Nor NorCal people. <laughs> okay, well, well, in this, in this 2012 beyond. I mean, you know, you, you beat us what? when you first came. 2012 beyond? When, when, when was the last time that you beat me? Ooh. Yeah, okay, yeah. I don't know what year, but it's definitely 2012 or later. For sure. <laughs> Tell me about... No? Did I suck uh, in 2012? I... What was the deep? Did, did you which, play? Which, the deep was for sure in 2012. No, Zach didn't go. Otherwise the deep wasn't. The deep wasn't. No, the deep was in 2012. The deep was in 2012. The deep was in 2012. So okay, fine. No one else in NorCal has beaten the three of you. Scar <laughs> has. Cool. We can move on. Tell me about the Berkeley tournament. Oh. I wanted to talk about my shirt. I've been sitting here listening Actually, to you guys. I don't know what you've been talking about. I heard that we were going to tell a story about my shirt. And then all of a sudden we're telling every tell tell the story in NorCal, tell minus scar. My, go ahead. I feel like I brought up your shirt first. I'm not. I'm not even going to. Oh, you did. You did. Thank you. Thank you, Zach. <laughs> no one recognized what this shirt was. The person closest to recognizing it instantly was Atrioc, who here to my left. He looked at me. He said, "What's up?" I said, "Do you recognize the shirt?" He was like, "I don't know." I was like, "Come on." He was like, "Peko." Yeah? <laughs> Just Hype. like that. You got it? Yeah. Momuchi Chappi. Got it. 
other people get it. This is, in fact, the t-shirt that uh, Peko wears when he's chilling in uh, Tamura's Tamura's the dojo. Dojo. It is ping pong. I uh, just felt like, I don't know, I needed this shirt. I needed it. Where did and, you uh, find it? And, in fact, every day, BJ's cool. Better calm down. <laughs> Every moment that I've worn it today, I felt good about my whole life. Really? Where did I find it? I did not find it. Ooh. I looked all over the internet trying to get this shirt. I ended up having to go to uh, customink.com. I checked out very uh, like other questionable t-shirt creation sites. My wife warned me against one of them. And uh, turns out that you can only get the baby blue American Eagle, uh, American Outfitters, whatever t-shirt. was blue. Or is Baby it, blue. Is it okay? Baby blue. Uh, you can only get it if you order a minimum of six. Oh, <laughs> interesting. And so, faced with the decision, right? Can I get this T-shirt, or do I just have to hold the L and never ever wear a pecker? <laughs> never wear <laughs> right, right, right. Gets how much is one? Thirty some bucks. Thirty some bucks. Okay. Okay. So this is my hundred and eighty dollar T-shirt. <laughs> I have five others sitting at my desk. Uh, really? I had to. I had to talk my wife down hella hard. Wait, 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 wait. You cannot have one. No, 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 no. <laughs> you absolutely cannot have one. And I just want to wear them uh, like sequentially. I'll just wear wear them and wash them. Am I only gonna see you in this forever? Because like six days out of the week, if I don't know. I mean, week. I have. I have. I have this one. I you don't know what I'm gonna do with the five others. I was them. thinking about you perhaps, could probably sell them. perhaps, giving some away to the faithful viewers of the <laughs> Scar and Toe Show. Maybe every time I win the set, somebody gets a Peko T-shirt. Or maybe I keep them all myself. <laughs> right. Um. <laughs> sure. So faced with that decision, I decided. You know what? Cross that bridge. This is this it. is going to be the best T-shirt of all time. Looking at it, I feel that it is the best T-shirt of all time. Route card ninety six. Welcome to the family. Thank you so much for the subscription. You keep saying T-shirt. By the way, that's a, uh, a long sleeve. That's a long. It's, uh, it's a T-shirt. Do they say T-shirt for long sleeve shirts? Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I, that's a technicality. I, How do you feel? About I wouldn't call it a T-shirt. I don't think. I think t-shirt's got to be above the elbow. I think that's what's good. Maybe if he rolls it up, and then it's a t-shirt, but... Well, I have to wear it rolled up because NorCal decided to be extraordinarily hot. <laughs> that is, that is yeah. the damn Decided truth. to not follow the pattern that's been established since... I... 44. Yeah. Uh, the world has been... The world has been absolutely crazy recently. I started a Twitch this week. I said, okay, I'm going to start wearing hoodies, bring hoodies to the city because it's going to be cold in San Francisco like it always is. Uh, and so far, both days on my way to work, I'm taking my hoodie off like it is too damn hot. Yeah, it was, what, 91 at 5 o'clock yesterday? Yeah, that's, that should be happening. Ping Pong is the best show of all time. Yeah. Please watch it. If you haven't, it's what's up. You've seen it. Yep, um, only three times. Yep. Yeah. I've seen it like 7 million times. <laughs> anyway... Bobby has this thing. Bobby has this thing where he legitimately... Thank you so much to everyone saying congratulations. Uh, I'm still kind of in the process of getting adjusted, uh, which I'm not going to sit here and John about. Anyway, uh, part of the reason why we don't have headsets. But... Oh, gosh, little sky, baby. Welcome to the family as well. Thank you so much for supporting Melee and Omni. Absolutely, thank supporting you so much. Scar, supporting Scar, supporting Tof. Ski Gaming, baby. Ba gaming, baby. Um, what was I going to say? You were talking about Twitch. Yes. You just said it ten seconds ago. Scar has this unique ability. Uh, one of the things I've learned about Bobby in my years knowing him, Scar has this unique ability to remember quotes from movies, television shows, works of literature that, like most people, you would... So you're like watching a show, and you... I, I know you will, because I know you pride yourself on this. You're, you're watching a show, and you... Sometimes you get it, absolutely. Dude. It's over. It's legal, right? This show, this is just going to be the chill show. <laughs> this is the chill show. <laughs> no headsets, it's a chill show. <laughs> I'm not going to be the chill show. It's like when the mice are away, the cat, when the cats are away, the mice will play. 
I think Spencer's the cat. Spencer's the cat. Spencer like Spencer is absolutely the cat, dude. Spencer is just like this uh, this paragon of quality. Yeah. When he's not here, we just do <laughs> we just do whatever the fuck we want. No, that's absolutely the case. Let's really take it down. Can you just flip that camera upside down? Let's just make the quality way worse. This is the Star Talk show. I, I still think it's it. actually on the screen. You probably gave everyone a bad ending. Well, you gotta put that back. You gotta put the guest on there. Who cares where it is? Perfect. I feel like. Is that good? Oh, that's better, actually. See? A little more chill, a little down to earth. Just, let's just chill. <laughs> yeah, that was way better. Can the people hear HR? They can hear HR. Two the things that I'm amazing at. Number one, remembering quotes. Number two... <laughs> <laughs> Number one, remembering <laughs> quotes. Recognizing voices. Mm. Meaning what? Yeah. Let me go into... I want to go into number one. Can I go into number one? Because I've... Um, what the hell? Okay. So, Bobby, it's not just, like, remembering quotes, because everyone knows, everyone will hear, like, quotes that you know you're supposed to remember, like, Luke, I am your father. Like, everyone, everyone knows quotes like no, that. Yeah, okay. You know, or, Bye. you know, four score and seven years ago, like, things that you hear, you know, timeless quotes, timeless phrases from pieces of literature or, or pieces of, you know, histor of, hi of history, and, and you know you're supposed to remember it because it's big and it sounds epic. Bobby remembers quotes that you, you, you would think no one would remember, like, like you, I don't. What you know? Some you know some quotes from ping pong that I I just I I, I have Probably. to think about. The the one I remember is uh is is was I was talking when I first became aware of this ability that you had was when we were talking about. I think it was. I have a million the Matrix quotes. You have a million. I have a million uh, uh, Spider Man one quotes. Spider Man one one of the best uh, one of the best films of all time. By the way. Yeah. Tobey Maguire. Tobey Maguire. Maguire Spider Man one. You just made a face, eh, truck What's your face about? Quote it. Give me a quote. Quote it. Give me a One of my favorites is like they're 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 interviewing all the New Yorkers about uh, what they think about Spider-Man. One dude, he's like looks hella mad. He's wearing the construction hat. He's got like a wrench in his hand. He just points to the camera. He says, "He stinks, and I don't like him." <laughs> ten out of ten quote. I feel like I, I feel like I remember that. I feel Peter like Turtle, welcome to the family. I feel like now you say it, I remember it. J. Jonah Jameson, uh, looking at Peter Parker's photos. Yep. Crap. 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 Yep. Mega crap. Does he say mega crap? Yeah, he says, he says mega crap. Who are you asking? Who are you asking right here? Uh, hit me with Matrix. Oh God. The one, the Stop one. Stop trying to hit me and hit me. No, no, no. That's a quote, quote. That's a, that's a everyone knows quote. I, I want some crazy. Sh like the one I remember is one time you were asking me about something about nutrition, something about food, because we were talking about this was back in the day. We're talking about like how you I were, know all this. And I give you I, right. That one? Yeah, I hit you with some info. Oh yeah. And you hit me with why do you know all this? And then you kinda look how? and then you kinda How do you know all this? Yeah, how do you know all how this? How do you know all this? And you and then you hit me with this look. You were like 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 you were expecting me to oh, Welcome to the I family know. butterfly Joe. Thank you for all the work so you put in. Joe. Uh, <laughs> sorry about that that one lost to Pat Rowdy observes LOL Scar loves talking about himself. Wow. Thank you, Pat Rowdy, for watching literally anything that I've done for the past four Five, years. Yeah, right. Right? Yeah. It's just, uh... That's just truth. That's just truth. Um... So, uh, what, when he's... No, like, yeah, he I says hit that when he's like, you know, look out the window, there's a scaffold there. How do you know all this? How do you know all this? And then, uh, Morpheus is just like, shut the fuck up, dude. Just listen to what I'm saying. Right. It's, it, right. It's, it's... The other thing is, like, when, when Neo's look... When he, before he's Neo, he's, yeah, like, he's yeah. looking around the office. That's the best that's yes I've ever heard in my life. It. Dude, that's so hype. Where he's just like, uh... Like the moment it kicks in that he's fucked. He asked... He asked... Fuck, fuck, fuck. Yeah, yeah he, he, he asked something like, you know, uh... I think they said, like... Morpheus says, like, they're coming for you, and he's like, who? And Morpheus is like... He says something like, stand up and see for yourself. Oh, and Neo shit. gets up, he sees the three agents, and he's like, oh, shit! <laughs> Morpheus just like... Yeah. <laughs> That's so good. See, I don't remember that. So I remember that whole scene. scene, and I don't remember that. I don't remember, like, the, the, the frickin', uh, you know, I remember the, I feel like I remember the scene where he goes out on the scaffolding, you know, he's, he's, he's climbing around everything. I don't remember any of the actual quotes. Um. And, uh, also, the, this is probably a quote quote, but, you know, the Ben SW emote, best e no, according to Oscar, <laughs> oh, yeah? best emote on Twitch. Which the best new emote on Twitch, which I agree with, sure. Ben SW putting his hands in his hair like this, 
when was that? It was at Evo, this most recent year, Stream 1, just something heartbreaking happened. I think you it was, go, go I feel like it was Hugs, Hugs versus Hugs Chew. Hugs BMB. Hugs BMB. I feel like it was Hugo Chew, yeah. Not like this. Show us your fail, uh, which, not fail fish. Which, not like this. The, the, <laughs> best, the best part about that emote, I believe, is that it's been SW. The second best part about that emote is that I came up with not like this. Because Ben asked me, what should the, what should the red text be? be? And I said not like this. Thank you to Scar, and also thank you to the Matrix. <laughs> when, wait, where is not like this from the Oh, Matrix? you don't know? I don't. What? That's a quote quote. I know, the blue pill and the red pill. Yeah, that's a good one. I'm with him. Uh, it's, uh... Spoilers. If you haven't seen the Matrix, you guys are scrubs anyway. Uh, you remember Switch? The lady with the blonde hair? Yep. So they're like chilling, and Cypher is like, Oh, I turned on everybody. Lol. And he starts unplugging people. Apoc dies. Oh. And then he tells Trinity, Do you have anything terribly important yeah, to say okay, to Switch? Now. You know, say it now. Oh. And then Trinity just looks over at Switch. She's just like, Not like this. <laughs> Not like this. <laughs> and she dies. That hurts. Not like Zeus. I hate that guy. Uh... I have amazing voice recognition as well. Oh yeah, go ahead. I just that. hear somebody's voice, I'll just be like, oh dude, it's that guy. I knew, I watched Gilmore Girls. Gilmore Girls is phenomenal. Beep. Don't even say it. <laughs> Gilmore Girls is a phenomenal show. And uh, I knew that... Uh, you know, I've, Luke, actually, I've actually heard really good things about Gilmore Girls. 10 out of 10 show. You probably don't know who it is, but Luke's son, he just like shows up, and I heard, I heard his voice for like one line. And this is like years before. And I knew... That he was the same actor as Rocky's son in Rocky Balboa, only because I heard the Rocky motivational speech. Ooh, Those like two lines yeah. of him being like, "Oh, the boss doesn't like me, and you know it's hard growing up in your shoes." Yeah. And then Rocky's like, "Shut up! Yeah. Nobody's gonna yeah, hit us no. all his life. You gotta get back." I don't remember what he says, but I knew it instantly. Mm. I also recognize Obaba in mm. Ping Pong as the same voice actor as Goku, which makes me godlike in my opinion. That's true, because they're not even the same. Those characters not even the are same not even the same gender. Boom! I heard it and I was like, yeah. is that Goku? Yeah. <laughs> is that. Is Obaba Goku? And she is. And I was right. Anyway. That's crazy. Enough about me. Those are some pretty necessary skills, though. Yeah. Those are those How are good. Get here? Those are good crop dishes. How do we get here? Uh, Dude, weren't we gonna talk about you guys going to Canada? Yeah, I'm down. I wanna, I wanna interview. I wanna interview Zach. I wanna talk about <laughs> some of the. I wanna talk about the stuff like you care about when it comes to Smash. What's been on your mind lately? Um, I wanna hear. Why do you wanna talk about Smash? We always talk about Smash. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what do you wanna talk about? Yeah. What do you wanna talk about? Uh, How was Paragon? It was alright. Tell me what sucked right. about it. I mean, the obvious. It cancels it very doubles. Obvious. Very obvious. You know, Why did they cancel doubles? doubles? Because I don't know anything about this. That, from what I heard, got there, you know, and <clears throat> from the start, I believe, uh, I know they were doing, I, I know there's a couple reasons they were doing at the door registration, which is very difficult to, to properly execute these days. Because there's so many people. Was anybody at uh, Clash of the Titans 1? I wasn't. This is when Brawl first came out. Chibo Senpai oh. ran the most amazing tournament of all time with door registration, and literally, uh, it was like 5 p.m. before they started any any brackets whatsoever, when and everybody open? was cheering money back <laughs> by the dude. end of it. I remember he was like snuck out by Drexel security. What, that, that uh, doors open at 11? And they yeah, they opened us? at like 11 a.m., and they were doing... Uh, and no brackets started till 5. That's not good. That is not good. Yeah. So that's registration at the door for you. That's that is re that is registration at the door. The the other big one was that they're bracketing. It was either bracketing software or something on the, the tablets failed. You know, you the mm -hmm. system with tablets so the the pool captains etc could report. Yeah. Um, they they had that at the first Paragon in Orlando. And, and it worked out. Yeah, those were really. I mean, they were a little glitchy, but for the most part, they were pretty solid. It right. had your your match, who you had to play, and then you just clicked that you won, and then it was done. And that was it. You didn't need to report to anyone. You know, it was good. It was, for the most part, pretty fluid. But it didn't work out this time. And it seemed like it stalled the tournament. That's what I heard. For two hours. Yeah. 
And, that, and not only that, but but then when things started, it's, it, it ran a lot slower because, you know, I did not know this until I guess this past weekend. Um, Jungle Guy learned from Jungle Guy. Evo Evo to this day only does paper brackets, and yeah. apparently they always will. And I guess that's, you know, yeah. I guess this is you know a, a strike in, in its favor, which is to me is weird because you think we're in 2015, everything is electronic these days. We rely on electronics for literally everything. We rely on, you know, networking software, et cetera, to be, you know, pretty airtight. You'd think this is something that we'd have figured out by now. So I, I don't know. I, and, and that's not to blame Barry. That's just to say, like, it is, you know, the, the things that TOs have to put up with is, it's, 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 it's stressful, and I get it. Who is Rudolph? Rudolph. He's the, the Japanese mark. Did you meet him? Chic. I did. I, well, so... I I had Bobby Bobby Siege mm. walk up to him and I was like you have to go talk to him first like I can't nice I can't talk to him you break the ice yeah and then uh, Bobby was trying to explain to him hey you have a really cool fox because you know after I lost to Amsa we we googled fox versus Yoshi oh. and, and Amsa you know lost to Rudolph mm -hmm. we beat him pretty bad mm -hmm. and uh, and so Bobby walks up and he says hey you have a really good fox but Rudolph isn't understanding what he's saying so mm -hmm. then I. You know, translate. Yeah. Like, Fox, you watch all of this. Okay. And okay. He's like, oh, yeah. oh, thank you, thank you. And then I introduced myself, and then that was that. Was that. But yeah. I didn't get to play him, which I'm kind of sad about, but next time. Next time. Okay. Two game off to one? Yeah. With his Fox? Yeah, he Pretty did. Pretty good. Did he, like, three stalked him, right? Or two? Maybe two stalked him. And then lost the set. That's yeah. the scar. Yeah. That's <laughs> the scar. That, that is, no, that is the scar. He, he is, he assumes the position. <laughs> Um, but yeah, they, they canceled doubles. Like, they canceled was, doubles. That was a huge disappointer. Lame. Especially since we just won the last doubles event. You know, I game. think, uh, I think doubles is stupid. <sighs> me and Otto, me and Silent Wolf, my teammate, and say me, and, me and my teammate Silent Wolf, Otto is a guy who or is very rarely, very, rarely hype oh, very rarely hyped for teams. Otto's very rarely hyped for teams. Melee it on me. And me and Otto were car. warming up for doubles, mm -hmm. and Otto said, dude, I am, I am never pumped info. for teams, but I'm really pumped for teams this tournament. Otto said, I'm actually really excited for teams this tournament. I'm, I'm, you know, I'm, I, I, I feel like I disappointed <laughs> uh, S-Fat, Zach, with our, 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 our performance at the last NorCal local that we teamed at. Oh, um, oh that's right. I heard yeah, Jeff and Mitchell good. played yeah. very well. We... Yeah, Jeff played very well. That was, that was rough. Yeah, no, they did. We lost 3-2. To both. Jeff no, and Mitchell. Yeah, yeah. 3 0 to Allen and Juan, but then 3 2 to Jeff and Mitchell. Otto has never beaten, he tells me. Otto has never beaten Jeff and Mitchell. <laughs> Silent Spectre and Ted, the, the <laughs> Wombo Combos. Otto has played them many, many times series. He said, never beat them. And he said, like, he's like, this is my chance to beat them, finally, you know, with SVAT, because we should beat them. And then, he, and then he was like, oh shit, I guess I just can't beat them. <laughs> so, but no, he was very, he was actually excited to play teams, so it was actually, like, kind of heartbreak, because I was like, oh shit, I just want to Maybe he jinxed it. Yeah. When I was, when, when the announcement was made, I was actually playing friendlies with Wizrobe, and I asked Wizrobe, I said, Wizrobe, who are you teaming with at this tournament? And he said, I'm teaming with S2J. Yeah. And I was like, I know, I know. Whoa! That's know. crazy, Wizrobe, S2J, that sounds, that's cool. really, that sounds really exciting, Double Falcon. <laughs> uh, what happened? And then, you know. How'd they do? Got kids? Uh, well, they tied with every <laughs> other team at the <laughs> tournament. Forgot the, the premise of the <laughs> the premise the of why was the whole thing, right? <laughs> there it is. No, yeah. that that sucks. That would have been cool. Uh, I really like double Falcon teams. Pretty crazy. Yeah, they were. On I our, think our watching side doubles too. is a lot harder than watching singles. Yes. Mm -hmm. There's uh, a lot going on. A lot going on. Yeah. But uh. Yeah, so you, you don't like doubles. I think it's stupid. Not even when we team. So wait, wait, wait. this is. I love. I did love when we teamed. Uh, yeah, see, everyone loves when you team with someone who likes doubles. When you team. Oh my god, when I team with when I team with Dewan or when I team with Kevin or you, although we we haven't teamed in the yeah. longest time, that's why. I, mm -hmm. We're supposed to team. Time. Us? We're supposed to be a team. Every time we've teamed, we've done amazing. You know uh, well, aren't we? Didn't we say we're going to be a team like hell soon? Yeah. Let's do it. When, yeah, like when right after Big House. House. Right after Big House. Sure. Because okay. he's team with G Money. I'm team with G Money at Big House. Uh -huh. And then. Uh, I am team with G Money at Big House. And then Smash GG decided to sell me to the people, which I'm. You know. No. Very happy Which you, you belong it's to. Not too bad. I feel like you've always been about the people. There you go. People's chat. That's what I'm saying. Let's, we should mention that pretty quick. If I had to be sold hey, to hey, anyone let's, else. Let's go into that pretty quick. Hey. 
check out smash.gg. Check out the well, Big House 5 compendium. Is the, is yeah, the first thing you'll see. Uh, me, and, me and Bobby are actually doing a whole bunch. You, probably you guys have heard of it. Uh, I talked about it at Paragon. Um, we're going we're gonna to tweet about it later too. But basically there are a bunch of donation incentives uh, that you can, you can unlock where we will specifically do stuff. With you, as a viewer, you can buy our tags. <laughs> That's right. Like your like little you know, your name tag thing. You you can choose in -ga what in game tag. In game, in -game tag, tag. The four uh, characters. Uh. So you can literally. You you haven't been bought yet, have you? No. I think I'm I think I'm done. But you guys can I have collectively. Been, I have a teammate. You guys can collectively. Yeah, you have a teammate. Do you know who it is? I have a teammate. I do not know who it is. Uh, Find out. Thank you to whoever donated five hundred and six dollars. <sighs> That's about how much I would I pay. That, uh, I would pay exactly seven more dollars than that <laughs> for Bobby. Do you, you get that one? Nope. <laughs> I'm bought. Uh, yeah. Please uh, pull your money. Buy the sixth tag for Scar. I will chip in. If it's what the people want. I'm what look at the, look at the stream right now. I'm looking at the stream right what now. What choice do I have? <laughs> if the people were to tell me that they believe that I got sixth place at yeah. Genesis, you know immediately I would uh, go to the nearest mountaintop and I would say, that's the way it is. Right. Through a very fair, though unorthodox, tiebreaker match, which I did not want to do, but was forced to do by the tournament organizers, I had to play out my fifth place placing, even though everyone else in the history of Melee, when they were one of the six people who got top five, because that's how it works, there are six people who placed fifth or above at every other tournament. Genesis made the completely DBR, DBR, decision. Uh, DBR, a crew that, that however, are forerunners of a lot of different. <laughs> however, the people have consistently told me. Mm -hmm. That they believe that I was unfairly subjected to that tiebreaker match versus Mewtwo King. DBR, the, the and progenitors. That the double elimination bracket. Doing a lot of things. Doing I placed things, fifth. Being, being the forerunners of a lot of things, you know? Pioneering. <laughs> you know? DBR. We're talking the king. No, you know what a failed We're experiment is that nobody else does We're it talking ever again. Sharon. We're talking great <laughs> NorCal minds that came together, brought Melee back from the grave, you know? And, uh, made you play that shit up. Should be Mewtwo King. I don't know. Mewtwo King was six. <laughs> I wouldn't be Mewtwo King either. In I'm a, sorry. In another universe. In another six. universe. This card is actually fit. Dunk. Be chillin', dude. Dunk be chillin'. <laughs> Do we talk about that? I don't understand. Did is you it, watch it? You there? No, I, I didn't watch it. I heard about it. But I didn't Has know. Dunk's power level increased? I think, uh, I think chillin' is permanently on the BTV now. I don't know if you guys know the ATV and the BTV. He's just not being streamed. He's on the, he's on well, the, the TV. You know, there, there's two streams. There's the ATV upstairs and then the BTV downstairs, which is either Joey's or, or Lucky's stream. Mm. Or, or Johnny's. Or Joey's Alex's, I, I guess. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Right. So I think uh, if you ever get force stocked on the ATV, you're automatically on the BTV for the rest of the night. Wow. And uh, wow. King, or Dunk is the king of the BTV, so I think... Chillin' might be on the BTV from now on. That's Next rough. time he goes over, but uh Sorry Chillin. Please Sorry, Chillin. Yeah. once more, please chillin'. Just pay me the hundred dollars. Please do not double or nothing money match me in Street Fighter because <laughs> I will beat your ass and take two hundred dollars from you. Uh, for everyone who wants to see justice served in the Melee community, please ask Chillin' Dude to donate $100 to Melee It On Me because he lost a bet fair and square, 5-3. He won the first three games. Oh. And then I beat his ass five straight after I downloaded him <laughs> into my system and you know, outputted the superior strategy. <laughs> Dude, that's rough. So you know, 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 the best part is because you know, he went, he won three games and he's feeling real good. Oh no, you should That's watch it. That's when you the get the, you get the full roller coaster of emotions. It. You can actually watch it. You can probably I, trace it and see his face change. I almost beat him 10 rounds straight. He took one round. Oh shit. Which, which was it like towards the beginning? I was like right in the middle. Okay. Jesus Christ. Yeah. Please head on over to twitch.tv slash chillin' dude <laughs> and let him know. 
You gotta pay up, man. <laughs> this is America. Uh, and if you would like to not pay when you lose your bets, please relocate yourself to another country. You know, I was almost gonna feel bad about us breaking up Chilli uh, losing to Dunk. And now I feel less bad because because of the whole $100 thing. So. He got 9th in Evo 2014. He got 9th in Evo 2014. He beat West Walls. He was very close. To, he was very close to getting top 8. It was him and Fly to make top 8. Atrioc with the That's crazy. incredible observations. Yeah. He tied with Levin. That was the whole thing. Is there any is there any news about Scar and Mike Ross? Any cl collaboration news? I don't know. Guess we'll have to, <laughs> guess we'll have to see. Guess we'll have to see. No, no spoilers. Who knows? Um, what were we talking about before the compendium? Mention the compendium. The compendium is supposed to be a book. I swear to God, I started talk talking about <laughs> something with that. I don't know what Smash GG is thinking. They have nothing book like. So the name is the name. Well, the name sounds really cool. I'll give it that, but it is confusing. It is confusing. Um. How do we how do we get more people interested in doubles? How do we get? I want to go back to that. I want to go back to that. Not so the other side of it. We have okay in this couch. We have like a gradient. We have like a slider <laughs> you can drag, and you have loves teams. I'm gonna say I love teams, but not nearly as much as this guy. I like teams, hate teams. So I wanna I want you first to talk about what you don't like, your your beefs with it, as eloquently as possible, and then I want you to sort of defend your position. And then I want to ask you about how you got so into it. And you were free in your spiel to talk about Genesis and how you and, and, and how you and Dark tore it up. So, that, so take it away. Teams. How do you feel about teams, Bobby? I think teams is dumb. Well, I don't like playing teams. I don't like watching teams. I think uh, there's too many too many characters on the screen. I think Yoshi's story is stupid in teams. <laughs> This is a whole laundry list, dude. This is the whole... So, what about at Genesis 1? How did you feel about teams? Genesis 1? That smile and girl here! That was the most, <laughs> was the most genuine smile I've ever seen. In civilized history. age of Melee, where people played with honesty... Integrity. And integrity. Dignity. <laughs> dignity all over the place. And, you know, Dark and I just had superior spacing, punishes, reads... Than the other teams. We beat Mango and Lucky. We beat J Man and M2K. Mm -hmm. We beat Kage and whoever. We beat S and PPU on Corneria. Didn't even remember that. Ouch. That was just one step Ouch. towards winning winners finals and being the uh, <laughs> top dogs. Until J Man and M2K were lame. And M2K switched to the Sheik. Who were they going in winners? Double Fox? Oh yeah, Double Fox was uh, really light work. And if you watch me specifically, I played amazing. Everybody's like, oh yeah, Dark. Ugh. He just rested everybody. Congratulations <laughs> on getting second. No. What was different? What was different with with uh? But now second in Genesis Scar. Yeah, what's changed since? Since then and now, I gotta say, I gotta say, every time I've teamed with you specifically, I've I've always been very, like, pleased. I've always had a lot Genesis of fun. Genesis was I've my always peak. Felt like, like, we That's just the way that it is. If Chillin wants a double or nothing, he's an idiot. <laughs> but we'll gladly take it. We'll take the money. I'll take the money. But I'm just on another level. Leffen, Leffen, you want to go, dude? <laughs> Do you want to go? Mm. Trying to money match? You wanna put a hundo down? Wanna put a thousand down? <laughs> Jesus. Let's do it, man. I'm the Street Fighter Master. <clears throat> Were we talking about teams? I don't know, man. I think team sucks. What do you want from me? I don't like it. Too many characters. Too too much. There's just too much going on. Is is that is that the feel of it? What do you think separates... Uh, you know what, you know what, actually, the, the, the big thing that killed teams for me, and this is the real answer, is okay. that back in the day, and, you know, it's mostly been a trend, especially at Nationals, between, like, 2009 to now, is that top players team with top players, and the balance of power, like, the, the strength of top players in singles is obviously far superior to basically everyone else, right? Once you get out of the top 15 or so, it's like, people just get smacked around. Uh, 
And so, when you have the top players teaming with each other, it's like it's like everybody else just gets rocked. So, when you think about tournaments where, like, uh, I don't know, I think nowadays, nowadays the non-top six or whatever, like the non, non-gods or whatever, like, things have been more interesting, where people are taking sets off, like, top, 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 you know, S-tier players or whatever. But, you know, in 2014, and the first half or first, I don't know, quarter of this year, like, most of the time, if there's a top six, top six player, then you don't really care about the rest of the bracket. It's like, you already know who's going to win, so it's not exciting. Okay. The same was true in teams for a very, very long time. Okay. And it's very rare to see teams that deserve respect because they play teams better than the other players, such as Esfat at Puking You. So you're saying he's a light in the darkness? No, because there's only like two teams like that. So he's one of the very few lights in the dark. <laughs> and it's mostly all darkness, and he's not in every team's tournament. And so, what do I care? So you're if, saying, if, wait, 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 let me, let me start, let me kick this one off. <laughs> okay, okay. So you're saying, you're saying that if there's a team with a top six player, unless it's, unless PewFat's on the screen, they're just going to win. If there's a team with two top six players, that should, and, and, and no other teams like that in the bracket, and no PewFat, it should be done. In general, that's... Get on my level 2014. <laughs> you have to go 2014. Very, you, you said 2014. Get on my level 2014. Don't cut me off. Mango and Toph <laughs> versus The Darkness, Mewtwo King, and Hungrybox. Mm-hmm. Watch those sets. Might learn I a thing or two. I, Might learn a thing I or two. don't think that M2K is that good at teams. I don't game think 10 is that good. Grand Finals, <laughs> Game 10. Yeah. Took him, won a set. Took him all the way to the end. Lost the tournament. Lost the tournament. That's a great example. Yeah. So was uh, second at Genesis. Ten out of ten example. Getting to grand finals through winners and losing the tournament. Uh, I'm just mirroring your whole shit. Anyway, no, yeah, yeah. Talk about, talk about. So what do you, I, I want to know what, say, what do you think you do differently too. I want to hear. Well, okay, compared to, to all the other. To, to, to answer Bobby's or to add on to Bobby's, I would say the reason why it's so rare to see non top top players, we, you know, do well in teams is because people just don't put in the work. They, they have that mentality that Bobby has that I can't win, you know, I'm not teaming with the best, so therefore I can't win. But, you know, Kevin and I didn't start out as the best, you know, we, we just put in that work over years. And, you know, while we were placing ninth in singles, we were winning teams. So, you know, it's, it's just, you get what you put in. And if you're not willing to put that in, then yeah. Can we talk about M2K and teams? Okay. I see that Chat <laughs> believes that Mewtwo King is one of the greatest of all time at teams. No. I, what I have observed, with my commentator's eye and experience as a top player, is that Mewtwo King, in general, plays singles in teams. <laughs> he stays at the ledge, he does his Mewtwo King thing, and he is amazing at being Mewtwo King. However, in teams, I don't feel that uh, that he's specifically playing teams in a way that's, like, particularly, like, do you know what I mean? Like, he's not necessarily a strong teams player. He's an amazing singles player. He very rarely offers support to his teammate, as far as I can tell. He will, of course, save people as they're coming back. All the fundamentals, in general, Mewtwo King has down. Mewtwo King is one of the best players to ever play Smash, ever. Right? So, I mean, I'm not saying that he's not good in teams relative to, like... Everyone else. Ev- yeah. You know, he's obviously one of the best teams players ever because he's, like, the, one best, of the best players player yeah. ever. Yeah. However, in teams specifically, like, I don't know. See, I would I would agree with you. As someone who's teamed with Mewtwo King recently, I teamed with him at, at EXP 2015, he doesn't play... He, you kind of have to adapt to Mewtwo King. He won't adapt to you. So you kind of need to just fit his team's style. And, you know, like, like Bobby said, he will just stay on the ledge, And but that's just his game plan, you know? And because of that, it's really easy to manipulate him in teams. So he's actually, he is really easy to beat once you can get around, and you, once you see his game plan, he doesn't change it up. Which is why I agree that he's not that great of a teams player. Same with Hungrybox. Hungrybox has a specific game plan in teams, and he doesn't really mix it up. Or, well, you know, he can't because he's Jigglypuff. He, he can only do so much. 
And so it's really easy to manipulate those two players specifically because you know they just, they stick to their game plan. But it's a consistent game plan, which is why you Lots. see them play so high and why those two particularly they have never lost a team's tournament ever. And yeah. yes, <clears throat> Muji King has incredible results. Yeah. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Right. I, I, I also kind of want to. I also kind of want to speak on this. More teams tournaments than uh, I don't know. And he'll do it in. And he'll do it in multiple games. Yeah. He'll do it in. He'll do it in brawl. He'll do it in. This is also, the. This, this is this is, is my. Like, this is, everybody's talking about the vape. This is because I'm stupid. Because I was addicted to cigarettes when I was young in college. I thankfully quit smoking cigarettes, and now I smoke this because I have a weak heart, and I I, I want nicotine. It's like, it's like smoking a cigarette. It's like, if you ever smoked a cigarette, which you should not, <laughs> ever, because it's a Don't horrible, do it. horrible, awful habit. Never smoked a cigarette in my life. Uh, you know, it's like, it's like I, my brain feels better. Right. Uh, you know why? That being said, so I've also teamed with Ruchikin before. Mm -hmm. I have, I, I teamed with him, the first time I actually, I teamed with him once. Uh, back when he basically owed me a favor, and I was really bad, and we actually lost the tournament. Um, and I've teamed with him, and I've won tournaments. The the one consistent thing that I will point out is that, and I think this kind of ties it all together because I've talked to I've talked to different players about this too. He does have a really interesting and unique style. He does tend to play the ledge. He d whereas some people you know can be kind of anywhere on the screen. He is at his best when he is at the side of the stage relative to all the other players. He trusts the mouse. No, right, throwing his needles, getting gaps. Yeah. The cool thing about team with Mute King, there's, there's, there are really cool things and really uncool things. The cool thing that I've experienced, we're good, dude. We're good, dude. I saw power save mode. I don't know, man. It is what it is, man. The, the cool thing, the cool thing about team with Mute King is you're just fighting, and all of a sudden, for no reason, you look at the stock count, and like, their the opponent's fox just has like one stock, and their stocks are disappearing. You don't really know why, but they just have to be disappearing. You can throw the fox back in Mute King, and he makes them die one way or another. It's weird. I don't know how he does it. It's crazy. The uncool thing about Team of Mute King, and you've seen it. You can go. You can go look at. Uh, you can go look at his old videos with J Man back when they teamed a lot. Mute King, because of the way he plays, he will actually leave his teammate to fend for themselves a lot, and he will yeah. be charging needles at the corner. Yeah. And if you are winning, and if you are hacks money, uh, you know, or you're J Man back in the day, you're able to fend for yourself. In a one-on-two -on situation, you have to do that a lot. Um, Mute King will... You can make plays with Mute King where you can, like, jump and he'll throw the needles under you. He has all these crazy setups, and if you team with him, he'll send you, like, pages on pages. Uh, Hugs tweeted about this, like, yeah, a week ago. Really. He will send you pages upon pages of information about specific strategies to beat specific <laughs> yeah. teams and, like, these little micro things he has. <laughs> yeah. But um, when you don't have those going for you, uh, like, you get one on two and he won't really help you uh, in the same way that, uh, you know, maybe a player like Kevin could, like, exert pressure and break up the situation or what have you. Right. It's different. It's really different. He will not leave his space. Right. He, he controls his, his little space, yeah. and he's the master of that little space, but he will not go outside. The, yeah, the Mute King zone, yeah. Yes. Absolutely. So it's like, if you can team with Mute King, there was, so, the, the tournament that really, like, illuminated this for me, uh... I feel like I'm putting him on blast. This is not me putting him on blast. This is me trying to explain How why we plays. have two. Because Mango, okay, at uh, Super Smash Con, I was hanging. We, we were in the room with Mango, and uh, you were at the venue or something. Me and Mango were going down, and Mango hit me with this actually very Reddit esque question. He said, "Who do you think would be a better team?" This is like the most Reddit thing I've <laughs> ever heard. Mango, Mango said, "Who do you think would be a better team? Me and Armada or me and Mute King?" <laughs> Oh, and I was Armada for sure. What yeah, do you yeah, say? But, but and I was like, you know, well, because because Mango, you know, Mango said, I think me and Armada, but like he's like, you know, because me and Mute King would team perfectly because whenever I team with anybody, I just tell him, you know, let me do everything. <laughs> I'm gonna handle it. Yeah, I, I just need someone. I just need a homie back there to like, you know, to back me up because yeah. I'll do everything, you know. And like, and, and Mango actually said, I think he actually said that a state. He said a sentence where it was like, I think Mute King is the greatest team player of all time. I think Mango actually said that. Or, 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 or he might have said second best, because, you know, but he <laughs> said something to the extent of, to the effect of that, which was like, to, like, I don't remember the exact quote, but Mango basically stated that he has immense respect for Mute King's team's ability in Mute King's own unique way. Mm -hmm. And I think that makes perfect sense for someone like Mango, and I think at that level, the level they play at, and given the people Mute King teams with, it makes total sense, because Mute King always says, he can't, he, I think he even admits, like, I can't carry that well. Because, like, Mute King and, like, a random person will do way worse than, like, Mango and a random person. Right, right. But, 
that makes sense because just the way they play teams. And so you get to these sets where it's between Armada, between Hacks, and they make it work. Um, and but yeah, like like so the the, uh, the 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 other side of the coin with Mango saying Mutating is hella good at teams. I played uh, it was me, Zoo, Otto, and Mewtwo King were warming up for t uh, for teams before the bracket on Sunday at the last Merit College tournament. Not uh, I'm not yelling, I'm not yelling. Or it might have been D5. I think it was I'm not yelling though. And we played three best of threes. Uh, it started with how the hell did it go? Me and me and Zoo beat Mewtwo King and Otto, and then me and Mewtwo King lost to Otto and Zoo. And I'm like, Mewtwo King is losing all these best of threes. And then I think I think Zoo ended up winning every side. I think Zoo and Mewtwo King then beat me and Otto. But yeah, like you wouldn't expect the top six guy to like you know be not like you would think just like looking at the statistics and looking at the people, you'd think Mewtwo King and Blank is just gonna win that. But because like you know we haven't teamed with him a lot because we you know maybe we were still warming up or what have you. Like, Mewtwo King couldn't carry the way he normally does. And so, like, that situation could happen where you would expect, like, oh, my God, Mewtwo King is just going to go crazy. And, like, but he doesn't because, like, that's not him. But I think I think that's the cool thing about teams is that, like, different, different people bring different things to the very top level. Like, even at the top level of teams, like, Mango plays even more, even more so than the differences between Mango and Mewtwo King in singles. Like, they have even bigger differences, I think, in teams because, like, not only are there, like, Micro games different, but their whole like outlook and everything's different. And then you have like Mac D, who's you know, like has absolutely top level results with Peach, and you know, no one, I, t t as far as I can tell, no one really knows how he does it because like, uh, you know, like, like. Well, I think I think it's because he just he's one of those guys that gets in there and causes the most chaos, and he just needs someone to pick up off his. Chaotic. chaotic. Yeah, he just he just needs someone to pick off his random hits, and uh, you know, Leffen, Fiction, all those guys, Foxes, you know, someone quick, someone powerful. You know, that's that's why I think MacD is so good. But by himself, he wouldn't be able to do that. Kind of like Mewtwo King, you know, Mewtwo King by himself isn't going to be able to carry just a random toe. Right. Well, right. Sometimes. sometimes. Right. Sometimes we we've done it. We've done it. Yeah. We've done it. But. Yeah, like like you said, like the way MACD wins teams tournaments is very different, like extremely different than the way like Mewtwo King wins teams tournaments or right. Armada wins teams tournaments, even though they play the same character. Right, right. Yeah. right the chat is going crazy about Luigi. Oh, God damn it! God damn it. <laughs> and I feel like we've one guy. We brought you over. God damn it! We so brought you. We brought by, you on the did show. Did you get hit by Nair? Is that what happened? No. What happened was okay. I played Raffle in pools. Not to take away from Raffles' win or anything, because he, you know, Ruffles he clutched it. But, uh, you know, I just got hit by early upbeat, and I air dodged a few times. Oh. Like, six times or whatever in the set. <laughs> you mean, you know, like, he was recovering, and yeah, you got hit by and I'm on the ledge. and instinctively hit L? Yeah, because, yeah, because I'm trying to roll, but I he upbeat early, and then he just, you know. That'll kill you. So, so that killed me against Raffle, and then I had to play. Now, here's my question. Oh. You said that happened six times. Yeah, give or take. This this sounds suspiciously similar to your story about how you lost a RuneScape, by the way. Oh, <laughs> yeah. People know about that. Anyway, sorry. Let's not break that one up. <laughs> Once more. About six times. Six times. Give or take. <laughs> My question... <laughs> is... <coughs> why? Why did you not stop hitting... Because you can't tech it. Can't tech it. It's just well, not good. I was trying to roll though, and but he would up B early. He predicted when you would roll and hit you with up B. I I guess you could say that, or I would say that I just fucked up. But you know, some people might say that he predicted my roll. I see. So you made the mistake six. Times? <laughs> now I want to say it's about four times because you've said six, three times. I feel now, better so hearing four times, but I really like the number six, as only you guys know. I actually am a big fan of the Thank number Thank you, Toph. <laughs> no one cares. <laughs> I feel a little bit better about four. But so, so, in bracket, you know, I was supposed to play Drug Fox, then Mac D, and then Leffen. My, you know, perfect bracket. Perfect bracket. But then I got moved like an hour before the tournament started, and I had to fight. Eddie Mexico. Wait, wait, tell me. <coughs> moved? 
reseed they reseeded the bracket the morning of. I guess they they wrongly reseeded it the first time and then they moved me to the correct seed. I see. Yeah. But so instead of Doug Fox know. and Weapon, which you would have been quite happy with. Yep. Instead, you had to play any Mexico. <sighs> Another Luigi. The only Eddie, other an incredibly talented player. Yes. Oh, uh, yes. I think that Eddie Mexico is so good. And you'd spent some time thinking about the Luigi matchup since your Rafa lost. Uh, no. So this time you were ready. No, no, not at all. I was like, fuck Luigi. Good thing there's only three at this tournament. I'm not <laughs> gonna have to play speaking, another statistically one. Statistically speaking, I should be fine. Yeah. Right. Yeah. But uh, of course, you know, I had to play him. Had and to play him. Uh, I did watch his matches, you know, before the tournament, but. So I took the first game pretty cleanly. The second game uh, should have been FD, but I that's where I beat Raffle, so I was like, I can do this. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I can do this. Mm -hmm. Didn't, couldn't do it. Can you tell me about uh, Luigi Fox on FD? Because Luigi, the one thing that I know about Luigi is that, first of all, Luigi does insane amounts of damage. Oh yeah, oh yeah. And also that like, uh, all the mess up. most of his moves pop you up slightly, and that's like, his combos are all just like you get hit up, and then you get down smash, down smash, down smash, like nair, or whatever. And hit off the stage. And all of a sudden you're at eighty percent. And his edge guard is actually very strong. Yeah. So, down air and forward air. Yeah. Uh, are really good. strong. So a lot of tell me about what FD does. For, and and also he moves super far away if you shine him, right? So so right. Fox's punish game is probably like no better. It's on not FD. that great. Yeah, yeah. What no. makes it what makes it hard is that you know he's moving. He can move so fast on the ground, but he can also stop instantly, you know, with his, like, I don't know how they do it mechanically, but they just, like, wave dash and they stop. Yeah, it's so that tricks, I don't tricks know you, you know, so you try to overshoot a Nair, but he stops yeah. before he goes that far, and then he just down smashes you four times. Right? Wait, how do they do that? I think they hold back, but I, I, I don't know. So they can wait I could figure and it and out run, in two seconds. I don't know. I think they wait dash for and run. Dude, I, how do Luigi do this is the crazy. I think I, I might have told you about this at, at freaking uh, at CEO. I was everyone's you know CEO. If you're at CEO base, you know that it's it's a party at night. Everyone's hanging out at the pool. Uh, it's a great time. I was in the pool, and you know like so like me and you, you know some, sometimes we'll have the fox moment. We'll be like, dude, I hate you know. I was just I was playing him so good. I won the neutral game five times. Then I got down smashed by Peach. I took so you know or or, at, or I got zero to death by insert character on this character's like screen. You know we'll have a little fox moment and we'll like kind of bond over like being a fox or whatever. <laughs> And every character Classic. has that. Classic. I was in the pool hanging out with Abate and Voodoo Jin, and they started having Luigi moments. And it was weird. It was I don't even remember what they were talking about. There was it was like like they were like oh man yeah and I, and I totally just and I blanked I I don't remember. There's some Luigi shit. It was like yeah I totally just wave dashed super far and and like they're like yeah you know I really get that. I was just like I'm watching two Luigi. <laughs> That's actually so. Funny. I, I've never <laughs> seen that. I've never seen that. I was like. What the well, well, you see it all the time with other characters, you know, two Captain Falcons talk yeah, about Yeah, 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 you don't see it with Luigi. Two Marths. Yeah, right. Luigi, yeah, Luigi's a rare, rare sight. Imagine you know two Donkey Kongs, like, imagine Fish It and, and Green Ranger, like, just really <laughs> bonding over, like, doing up it. I don't know. Anyway, Can I tell you the best figure. Falcon moment that I've ever had? Good. It was after some tournament in SoCal. Uh, this is after I had actually, uh, after I had moved to the West Coast. Uh... I was staying at Dump's house with like seven billion people, and it was me, Jeff, and Johnny, Ooh. all in the same room, just chilling. Uh, and I remember some like new Falcon, maybe it was Doug. <laughs> Can't say that anymore. He'd be chilling. Yeah, Can't say that anymore. He'd be chilling. Falcon, Move it up in the world. Ask the Falcon Legends, uh, me, Johnny, and Jeff, something about like you know. What was he doing? Like, what was he doing wrong versus this stupid fox? I think it was Gishnak running around being an idiot. Uh, and I remember looking at him, and I was like, I just pointed out, like, dude, what are you? What are all these down airs out of shield? And I remember, like, at that moment, I thought to myself, like, ooh, but I down air out of shield all the time. And I like looked at, uh, you know, one of S2J and Jeff, and I, I was, like, I think it was Jeff, because you know Jeff never talks, but if yeah. somebody doesn't talk, I like to ask them questions. And I was, it was, must have been Johnny, but whatever. Say I asked Jeff, I was like, hey, yeah, Jeff, what do you think about down air out of shield? He was like, sucks. <laughs> Obviously, perfect answer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then I was like, how much do you do it? He was like, every time. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the Falcon moment. We down air out of shield the all moment. the time. All the time, But dude. it's so bad. <laughs> but if it hits, it's, it. it's just everything. 
Dude, that's why. Uh, dude, you know when, what I, makes when sense? I play a falcon, when I play a falcon, I, like nine times out of ten, I will stuff the downer out of shield, and I'm just like, why do you keep that doing one that? Time, baby. <laughs> that one time it hits, I'm just like, oh my that god. That one time. That is the one. That is the one falcon thing. Cause like most of the time when I'm playing falcon, we're down airing if out I lose all day. Yeah, most of the time when I play falcon, if I lose to falcon, or if I'm or if I'm losing to falcon, or if they win an exchange, <laughs> I'm like, falcon. This falcon player is good. He earned that. That was good. But if I ever get stomped out of shield, I'm just like, oh my fucking god. Dude, Wade Lord knows. Why? Wade Lord, you know, dude. Everybody who plays Falcon literally understands what I'm talking about instantly. That's <laughs> so painful. Down here at a shield, I know it sucks, but oh, I'll never stop. I'll never stop. That's good, dude. So anyway, you played Eddie Mexico, he beat you on FD. And then he spanked me on Stadium and that destroyed. Well, oh, you struck that, dude. No, Battlefield. Oh, Battlefield, okay. FD, Stadium. Uh, oh, he can, stadium, oh, you won on Battlefield. Stadium, or, pretty pretty strong counter pick, yeah? Uh, Depending on how you play. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, Stadium's like FD, so I thought about it. I was like, this could go really terrible. Yeah. Uh, but I think he banned Yoshi's. Yoshi's yeah, so that's the ban. And I wasn't really comfortable with Fountain. Didn't really want to go to Dreamland. I think I might have banned Dreamland. So I was left with Fountain or Stadium yeah. or FD again. Well, forget those. So I think Dreamland's the only other even like reasonable choice, but I hate Edgeguard. Okay, so what's the, what's the rule here? If you ban a stage, can you pick that stage? I think you can. Yeah. I think, I think you it's can. scummy, but you can do it. Okay. I think you can. You know why? I think you know why I think that the, it becomes really clear hmm. is when multiple characters start getting involved. Oh yeah, because absolutely. If, absolutely. if I'm playing Mewtwo King, I might ban FD or I will ban FD. But if I can get into an, uh, a counterpick situation, I, and maybe I'm a in, in some alternate universe where I have a really good Captain Falcon, for example, and, and Fox, maybe I take him to FD, and then based on if he goes Marth, I can go yep. Captain Falcon. Yep. If he goes Sheik, I go Fox. Yeah. And then I have a winning matchup. No, I think for sure. Yeah. For sure. Um, you, can go, you can go to Dream Man, but I don't know that. That's a better stage. Yeah. Dude, FD, FD, you Did you play a Noto Luigi? Well, no. Awful and Eddie. No, the, 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 one thing, the one thing Fox has on Luigi that's real good on FD is um, the same thing he has on, like, Marshik, where not necessarily your combo game is better, but once you get them up in the air with whatever your basic launcher is, yeah. he has a real hard time coming down. And if you can bait the nair out and then, like, start nairing across the stage, that's when... You, that's when I mean, you it. absolutely have to bait the nair out, because, like, every Luigi is just like, oh! <laughs> oh! <laughs> or, they, or they come down with the down B. Yeah. Oh, I hate down B! Atriok in the chat, someone have chic moments with me. Drunk Fox Jr. <laughs> will have chic moments with you all day, dude. Atriok, hey, you know about Drunk Fox Jr.? Yeah, he's right here. He's sitting right here. Drunk Fox Jr. <laughs> Drunk Fox Jr., dude. Every time I... Anyway, I'm, I don't want to toot my own <laughs> chic's horn. Thank you, Bobby. Uh, what else? What else do we need to talk to Zach about? Mm. I, uh... So, you, you lost Eddie Mexico, and then what, did, then what happened? Yeah. Oh, uh, played... I don't remember what happened. Played pork chops? Nope. Uh, nope. There, you played someone okay. before that. Oh. <laughs> played someone before that. I had to play Toph. I had to play... I had... I had... I... Because, like, you look at the bracket. <laughs> I remember looking at some of my homies' bracket. I forgot. And the funny thing was, because I had a pretty decently, like, easy pool. I'm not going to say easy, because Kira's good. And he beat me. But, like, relative to people that had, like, you know, like... Like, I don't know. Like, Rawful. Like, come on. That was like there were there were a lot there were a lot of pools where it was not clear who would get out and my pool I was like okay it's just me and Kira even if I lose to Kira I get out I get reseeded in winners what's the worst that could happen I lost to Kira I go to the bracket I have hugs first round which I feel pretty good about because I play Daryl a lot and me and Daryl go back and forth and the set starts with hugs and about a minute into the first match this thought flashes through my brain and I'm like maybe I'm not that good versus Samus and maybe I'm only really good versus Daryl. And then another thought flashes through my brain, and I'm like, man, I really wish Hugs played more like Daryl. This would be a lot easier. And I get too old, and I go to losers, and I immediately have the loser of S-Fat and Eddie Mexico, which is S-Fat. And then I'm thinking, like, Ooh. and then I'm like, I had a really hard bracket. <laughs> and I we think... We had a close set, though. We had a close I, set. Yeah. Close to all. Yeah. It was... The kind of set where you forget about you played it, and then you go straight to pork chops. Yeah, so. but if I... But it, I could have lost it, and then I would have never forgotten about it. Yeah. I have an important question. Huh. Go ahead. By the way, losing to Hugs and Esfet at the same tournament, I pulled 11. Okay, go on. Esfet, do Sorry. you think huh. that if you had to compete with Scar and Toph as a team, that you would be able to win with 
Atrioc as your partner? Uh, easily. Easily. Do you really think... Do you, are you honestly saying that, or are you just, you know... Yeah, you know, if, I, if, I had like five, stream, if I had five minutes to listening. just prep with my teammate, yeah, you know, give them some basic Atrioc. dream strats... Flip the... <laughs> give, give me the preview screen, first of all, on here. I want to see what the people see. Can you I want hear the people? The, Sorry. Can you hear, hear the people, people stream? Stream. Uh, stream. I want to have the game cam. This is what we see. This is what the people are seeing right now. Beautiful. You just went I would like for you to sit uh, next to I gotta sit next to 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 Okay. Which helps because now we don't have unless I can't so unless I can't out. hear about the, the strategies. So if I strategy, if I if we win, does that mean I get to work at Twitch now? And one of you guys lose? Yeah, Tope job. Tope fired him. <laughs> yeah, he's winning here today. <laughs> I'm <laughs> not attached. We are. It's not long enough. We will money match for employment yeah. here. All right. Uh, All right. Okay. Basic. Well, tell me. Tell me what you know about teams. I know nothing. I'm coming in a blank slate. Okay. Right. Um, good. That's good. Yeah. Um, first, you need a controller. Got one. <laughs> So maybe so I'll listen to him. Uh, so um, all right, one, all right. Yeah, basic, you. basic team strats. We want to sandwich them, right? We want to okay. be on opposite sides of them and do as much damage to them while they're in the middle as possible. Uh, that's that's like strat number one, right? You play sandwich. Shoot, right? Yes. Yeah. Okay. No, that's right. that's fine because okay. you know down smash, down smash Love is a great it. one, okay. and then I'll back air into you, and then you down smash, I'll back air, then you can get a forward air, forward tilt, um, mix it up. And so, okay, that's that's like one strategy, right? All right. Another another common um, scenario in teams is when both of them are cornered and we can't sandwich them. Yeah. What do I do? So. Because you're gonna take point. You right. Need more damage. Oh, you're the fox. Right. Most of the time, I'll take point. Okay. Um, if you're at low percents, I'd prefer that you take point because you can just crouch against them. Count on me, buddy. You just you just walk up forward tilt. Uh, you know, just just keep pushing them away. But whoever, no matter who's in point, right? The front, if if someone gets by the front man, that's okay. the back man's job to swap them Put back. Put back in the yes. corner. Yes, exactly. No matter what. What should Atrioc do if I'm beating his ass? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hypothetically. Let's get let's get assume, real let's assume concrete situation. here. Hypothetical. I'm in the corner with Scar. We're both uh -huh. there. Uh -huh. And he's just beating the shit so out. So then you got to tell me, if I don't notice. Should I say something? Yes. Tell me. Tell okay, me say. you need help or yo. You know, what Kevin does. Let's get a code word Ke for like, if the situation. If the situation is going real poorly for me, <laughs> I'll say uh, dank memes. Uh, I'm going to say dank memes and that's okay. your code. To okay. just, that's you know, a little long, but we, right. can, well, sure, we can. I'll work. say it real fast. Okay. Okay. Sure. Sure. Yeah. So, no, that, right. that's totally fine. So we have two strategies you told me about. Uh -huh. Box them in. Yep. Both sides and then box them in the corner. Right. I'm gonna right. pitch you a third strategy. Okay. If yes. things go real wrong. Okay. Okay. I don't right. really like these real this wrong strategies. This is where we strategies. put Atrioc right. on the ledge. He starts okay. Shino stalling like crazy, like, <laughs> like, 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 like no tomorrow. Okay. And your okay. slot count goes from four to seven. You have at least three more shots. <laughs> I just want you okay. to think about. It. I want you to no, put that's... that. Now wait a minute. This is a legitimate thought that many many players have had. Right. Uh, respond. Yeah. Give me the truth. Um. Uh. Okay. Well. I don't really like to play teams like that because hey, me neither. I'm just giving you options. Uh, no, I, that's yeah. I respect it because that's you know that's how Muti King plays and right. that's that's a totally legit. He wants a tournament thing, but you know it's also. I mean, I want to get in the mix. Good. Zach, good I'm with you. I want to get in there. I want yes, to do some damage. Good. I want to fuck Scar up. I want to fuck Tug. Depending on okay, if things Watch go bad, if things go bad, then so you know we cut all the time. What we gotta do is we just gotta stick closer. We gotta move as one. Unit. Entity. Yes, one unit. <laughs> one unit. Why would you yes. say entity? You're just <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right, guys. Why are you sitting all the way back there? Are you guys, blue, the are you guys blue team? You guys um, I just blue actually want to be a blue team. Yes. Well, I'm going to whatever color Zach wants. Oh. I'm always yeah. blue yeah. chic anyway. That's perfect. Yes. Good. We're blue team. Can we make sure that, uh, we're blue team? Will you, uh, do me a favor and turn that TV off? Yeah. Do we, oh, well. do we need game sound? We gotta make sure that I'm on the that I'm in the frame zone on this one. Most important thing. We can very very easy. Let's flip this. No, 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 no. Very easy to get game sound. Wait, how'd you get in the middle? Do they get? Yeah, they this might guy get always gets in the middle. How'd you get in the middle? He's a wriggler. I, I want to play in the middle. I can't play from an angle. I'm not the best at it, but I'll, I'll make it work. Make it work, though. Oh my god. 
I think I'm Goku. Now shall so, yeah, we play first? Tags? Uh, His team's tag strategy pretty important. Uh, okay. Patriot, you're sending my board right now. I just made us pal. You're focusing on all of our teams. <laughs> yeah, I don't know if you need a... Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll play my share slot and then you quite a bit. Total strategy three. So. I'm going to put on the practice tag because they're going to have practice. That's appropriate. I'm going to switch it up on you. And we're right. going to... First three. Three. Yes. That's five. It feels, it feels right. Wow. Okay. Yeah. Communication. It's all about communication. And we're going to start on Battlefield. Are you okay with this? Of course. Of course. Always got to go out. Always got to talk to your teammates. <clears throat> Game sounds sound better, guys? You got Diamond. Sorry. Sorry. All right. All right. Good luck. Okay. Good luck. I Good get luck your job, you if you lose, so... Yeah, we bet that, sorry. My, my what? Whoa, neutral start's so strange. So see this situation right here? This is exactly where I was the first situation. Yeah. Where I'm in between them, and I just pass them back to you. Sorry if I, my talking during the set confuses or distracts me. Does it? I'm learning. Oh my god, you're right. Yeah, I think that uh, my strategy is to not get transferred. Because Patriarch cannot, uh, cannot hurt me. And in fact, we'll just die like that. <laughs> oh, Tove! Come on! <laughs> Rule one! Let the Falcon edge guard! I have a need, bro! I thought you were getting the stage. <laughs> oh, fuck. I just oh, killed Atriarch. Yeah, yeah, it's cool, it's cool. Yeah, Don't worry about it. Atriarch, you should help your teammate. No, I'm good. You, don't worry about me. Don't listen to Scar. But you let me know if you need help. I'm good. Fucking tough up. Don't worry. I'm on my way. Oh, Beautiful. What's that? What was that? What, what, what was that? Oh, what, why did you get me there? I was in the bathroom. We were talking about strategy, but that happened. I got, I got that one. Uh -oh. You did get one. Oh, I, oh, I had it. I missed it. Nice. Ah. Good, good music kid. <laughs> oh, good grab it. Oh, down smash, of course. I love When we sandwich them, that's when you want to bust out those down smashes. Oh, shit. There's no plan in there. I got you. I got you. I'm good. I'm good. Yeah. It's fucking scarred. Nope. <laughs> I want to see how he tries to save you. <laughs> oh, nice. You'll take you it? No, that's good. From that's good. Don't even trip. I want you to take it. Patriot with a big edge guard. <laughs> oh my god. I'm just holding my shield. Nice. Another I love this Batman strategy. Yeah, it's get past you and I have to hit him? That's dope. Yep. Whoa! Yeah, oh. my bad. Too bad Scar's recovery is so good. Otherwise, we have an easy KO. Yes, Atrioc tries, but fails. I got you. Ooh, nice. You still tricked me. Fuck. I'm coming, I'm uh, coming. I'm going back to the stall for a quick song. Nice. I had to slow it down. Momentum, did you? Yep. I almost got to. Oh, me and Atrioc are going toe-to-toe -to -toe right now, dude. <laughs> This is actually so bad. Oh god. Oh no. I'm oh, I'm so out. sorry! Oh, it's cool, it's cool. Are you living? No. You got it, dude, you got it. Believe in yourself. That's rule number four. Oh my believe god. Believe in yourself. Here it is. I believe in you, HR. I have nothing but faith. No! Oh my god. It's okay, Toe can Okay. We were close, we were close. Easy! That was one. That was did anyone one. in the chat think, oh, Tope and Atria? Oh! <laughs> Let's go. If you did. <laughs> Alright, Tope, the watch is coming off. Fuck you, dude. That was, that was a limiter. Alright, alright. What do you. What do you no bands. I don't know what to So I felt like Battlefield was. We were getting it. I was the bad start, dude. Battlefield's. What do you think? Because honestly, you're going to take, obviously, point. I like. I like FD. It really comes down to the teamwork. 
and it really comes down to where you can abuse those two strategies we talked about. The sandwich and then the they, Batman. They team. The Batman was working. It was. When I started thinking about it, it was amazing. Yeah, yeah. Just, the only thing about that is just be careful not get too close. All of Daffo's training Bible Pub. Then it's easy for them to get by. I hate you too, dude. I'm sorry. No, it's, it's, it's okay. It's going to happen. Right. It's going to happen. happen. I, I say FD. All right. Yeah. You know, they might have won that match. They might have won that match. You know what I'm saying? But now... Now it's time for me to, uh... Nice, there we go. Oh, yeah. Alright. Alright. Zach thinks he's good. I am the Ego Camp. Oh, the read? The reaction? Oh, oh I missed that. Oh, I should have read. Oh, the DI. That's not so scary. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I don't know what It's like we played our three on one. Scar, Scar, you go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what? Get out of my. So, so another thing I didn't talk about was that high percents, like right there. Oh my god, oh, that me. Thank you, girl. Look for grabs okay, at high percents. Okay. Because that's okay. where, uh, that's when we can really... Yeah, I always thought it's like never go for grabs in teams, so I never went there. Wait, what? Who said that? Oh no. It's certainly not me to me. Should have held me right there. Alright, what's it? Yeah, the hold, the grab and hold is super important. It's something that would be great if Toad did. <laughs> oh, no way! Of course, rolling back like a new. Zach's gonna have need some help. Turn me the roll. Yes. Oh, that's on your phone. Alright, we're a little cramped here. We need some space. I know it's coming. Oh, my roll. Oh my god. Fuck. You good? Yeah. Oh, you grabbed it. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, that's fine. We're good about this. Oh my god. Now we're. Oh, I'm actually oh. at the best spot, but I've gotten, so two, I've gotten, I've gotten two I'm kills that way. You have to you guys leave. suck. Just wait. No, no. Alright. Was it absolutely okay? Who was that? You destroy you right now. Just like just. We're about to wobble call the watch. You're about to wobble call the watch. You're about to wobble call one person. Were you. Oh, get him! Oof. Thank you! What do you want me to do? Up smash him in another? I'm gonna mash out like four times. I think we have because I was setting up for that more shit. Right. That yeah. was a fucking good combo! That was a good combo! Oh, yeah, I'm going to see? Let's fucking go, dude. You, everyone's all just, oh, what are they gonna do? They're gonna blow it. And then, see, we did, we did some good shit. Just gotta trust. He's struggling out like a legend. Oh, that's bad. Right. Hell, we good. Keeping it, keeping it honest. I mean, you're actually really impressing me. Because you know Atrioc is nowhere near a hero. He's still very much zero. <laughs> Damn. Diamond, Diamond though! Girl, dude, he knows. Diamond, Diamond, dude. Sort of. Yeah. Okay. Miscalculation by Scar. Is oh! The yeah, we're gonna jiggle. Let, let us wiggle out of the stream. Can you do it? Yeah. Alright, let's do it. Oh, sorry. Oh, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Ha! Zach thinks he's good. You're good, dude. 
guys. Oh, I got up there. Yeah. My, my, like my friend. I know. Probably we were homies. <laughs> oh, 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 what? what? You know, why are you not going to roll? He, he would have been out of the What the? Yeah. I don't know why that happens. You just want to see how long it's going on. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, oh no. Fuck you, dude. Suicided many, many times. Oh, I suicided many, many times. That was unfortunate. Okay. Yes! <laughs> they're, really ha they're really happy. You're right. Uh, that was, that was, yeah, absolutely. This could be the comeback. I knew uh, it. The team is <laughs> getting stronger and stronger. It's not going to be the comeback. You're a sensei, dude. Yeah. Where do we go? I did, what, 10 big episodes stadium, of Zero Zero and I didn't learn shit? Stadium, <laughs> I think stadium. Can we 20 stadium. minutes with that, Spat? We're going to stadium. Oh, fuck, I didn't know. Ready? Yeah, yeah, of course I'm ready, dude. Oh, hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> uh, of course I'm ready, dude. <laughs> quote. Quote. And I quote. See how I was ready for my partner? And, but then I hit the wrong one. My team's my analysis is that you know, we need to hold the middle because <laughs> S5 is too strong at the ledge. Yep. I think Atriox sucks. 
<laughs> keep talking, uh, dude. Every time I'm keep... isolated with Aatrox, I can kill him. Yeah, so I think know. that... Uh, sure. I you want me to hurt him on that? Yeah, and I'll try my best to keep hold him in the middle. Don't go to the middle. I think we need to hold the middle. Yeah. All right, Tobin's going to battlefield. I just want to beat them on battlefield. We're going to go to battlefield unless you guys object. Not object. No, we'll take battlefield. Good luck. We'll take battlefield. Let us go. This is for your job, Tobin. I'm still fucking out Zelda. I just did eight. We did eight billion damage, Satrion. Eight million. Count it. Exactly. Right here. Pressure is way too big. Oh, you got me out of there. That's good. Only Tobin Scar can kill Tobin Scar. Woo! Looking like West Balls. Make sure it messes up the shimmer. Slab of meat. That's what we call it. That. Treat your partner like a slab of meat. Down smash and grab. You're so lame, Phil. I hate you so much. Don't talk to your boss. Hold the middle. <laughs> Legend S fat in a 1v1 when you're down for sale. Those rolls a couple times, and that's kind of what was the game changer. Like, you, you want, want, I wasn't rolling. You want to any of my rolls. 
<laughs> you want to prioritize the middle, but you don't want to be afraid of being on the ledge because, you know, that's... Sometimes that's, you're going to be on the ledge. Yeah. Sometimes it's just going to happen. Sometimes, Sometimes you're just going to sit there and wait, see okay. what they do, and then go, but... And also you guys <gasps> killed each other like They're calling us zero plus zero. No, they're calling us zero, zero, zero plus hero. That's the show. I'm zero, oh, zero plus zero. <laughs> that's a great team name. <laughs> That's actually amazing. You're I'll still, take, you're no, I'll so, take zero. So you're accepting that you're still the zero. I, you know what? I had ten hours of training with Tapo. You think, <laughs> you think a legend comes out of that? <laughs> I like zero plus zero. I like zero plus zero too, dude. Good shit. Yeah. That's good. Yeah. You're amazing. All right. Well, that was fun. You clutched it. Oh yeah, absolutely. I, don't, I, I feel don't like, like I feel like was If anyone clutched it, there, it was definitely it. me. I feel like Hitchcock was absolutely the person that clutched it. Uh, yeah, I think the video will show. Most of the stocks were definitely just the shot clutch. It's not good. <laughs> All right, well, I mean, it was a 3-0 comeback, too. So. Yeah, well, that's how we do clutch it out. That's When you're diamond. <laughs> they won the first two, thought they were really good. You just kept teaching me, dude. I was learning along the way. Scar's bum, dude. And you still have to play the 1v1. Yeah. That's gonna Scar's, <laughs> see, <laughs> this is not like this, though, because, you know, Scar's mentally defeated. Yeah, he's broken. He's broke. Look at him. He doesn't want to say anything. I'm trying to yeah, learn from my loss. squared. You know, I'm sitting here thinking, we must have done something wrong, you know, because we're the superior players, collectively, in skill. So clearly, you know, small, well, some might argue. small minor adjustments, and we win that, you know? Maybe we didn't spend enough time strategizing, I don't know, I don't know what they talked about. I was having a great time getting my apple juice, sparkling apple. You gave apple. me some legit, like, team strategy. Like, you broke I lost my job, super simple. so that's unfortunate. Yeah, that's rough. <laughs> I'll turn in my badge, uh, but you know, but I'm gonna bounce back from this. We're gonna come, we're gonna come <laughs> back stronger. I'm gonna come back stronger. And now I'm thinking, Scar, mentally defeated man, is slim pick, easy pickings. Slim what did they say, pickings. slim pickings? Slim pickings, right? That's I don't know. Easy. I don't know. The, it's fucking. Why are you sitting so close to me? Because there are four of us on the couch. Yeah, I'll, I'll go in the back. <laughs> oh, you were that was that was almost you asked me that question, yeah, but yeah, it was yeah, kind yeah. of directly. I definitely yeah. see where. Uh, right, uh, right, right, right. I like that. I like that. Why are you sitting so close? I feel like so you know what you should have said was, hey, Atrox, get off the couch. Should have said that. You're much nicer. You're watching someone lose to Atrox. I lost to Zach. I lost to Esfet in a one-on-one. Well, one -on -one. I don't know if the chat's on that. Where are the mods? Can you ban Jimmy No Johns? Who's Jimmy No Johns? Atrox, mod. Mod like three trustworthy people. <laughs> <laughs> mod Butterfly Joe, I like that guy. I like that guy. Mod, mod Zelda Free. Can you mod, can you literally mod Zelda Free right now? Yeah, please. Where's my mod stuff? You're not a mod. You're merely on me. I'm you have, dude. Where am I? I don't know, dude. Don't you have a wrench? Wait, are oh, yeah. you sta your staff on the other screen? Or is it, are they both They're both the same screen. Are you sure? They're yeah. one computer. Koopa Troop will do it. Koopa Troop, ban Jimmy No John. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Let's go. Let's right, Let's do it. Thank you. As bad for no, showing us what showing a real team player can do. Can do. Now when pushed to the when pushed to the limit. I feel like against all odds, against two titans. <laughs> no, no. Mm -hmm. All right, so we're gonna go to battlefield game one, and I'm gonna win the title of my show back. <laughs> can you explain what we're doing? You know, not everybody has watched every. Not show. everyone, right? Not everyone has watched every show. We need to keep this. In your mind, as you do the show, when I am the host of the Scar and Toe show, I'm always thinking about the people. That is not. That is. You don't. You do not preface. You do not preface everything you do. With always the thinking that about the people, whether or not they're right. understanding what's happening on the show, whether or not they're enjoying the show. Yeah. At the end of every episode, me and Scar, uh, regardless of what has happened this far. Um, regardless of victories or losses in team sets that we may or may not play, Correct. Uh, play a best of five to determine who gets their name first in the show title at the beginning of the next episode. And well, at the end of the last episode, Scar defeated me in a fifth game last stock situation after many, many weeks of me 3 0 and 3 1 him. Um, so, sure. I mean, you know, just sure. shit happens. Uh, I've already lost my job, <laughs> but now it's time for me to win my show back. That's how this works, right? Seems worth it. That's how this works, right? Uh, S -Fat, feel free to... Question mark? Talk to the people about what you observe. Okay. Uh, in okay. this first to three... Literally, feel free to, like, just commentate. Just commentate. You can comment. Uh, Mike Ross even, you know, kind of was like, oh, I see this face in there. You could just drop some little <clears throat> S-Fatisms in there. Okay. What okay. you're seeing. Sure, sure. Battlefield game I mean, one. it'll affect your play, but... Uh, you can do, uh, you know, just commentate. It's fine. Okay. 
we'll be fine. It could be like the, that's the fourth time total. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna. Remember all the rules you were catching Bobby doing? <laughs> Who was doing those rules? You got me by the ledge once or twice. H Rob, when you H Rob, distracting. Oh, what's what's going on, dude? I just what do you keep going back? What? What, what? <laughs> what do you want to do? I'm thinking. What are you thinking? I'm preparing myself. Mental. Getting in the zone. Do, do this. Do this. Good luck. Good luck. This is first to three. Best of five. <sighs> <clears throat> All right, first first stage battlefield. Pretty classic stage. Let's see here. Hmm. Both of them kind of feeling each other out right now. Neither one wanting to commit too hard. I saw that my spacing was made. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Ooh! That late nice. up Interesting! Nice. The late that up air like scar. scar. That's some old scar stuff. The late up air. Mm -hmm. You don't always have to do your moves right away. <laughs> I love playing offbeat. Oh, shit. Uh, so if you're playing Pal Fox. Alright. <laughs> that, that, that is a heavy cap he is. He might not be, but... I don't think I, I, don't I, don't think I am. Destroyed. I don't think I am, because up smash yeah, just KO'd him. Destroyed. Well, he was at, like, 130 yeah. on the side. Alright, I think, you know, this, this matchup boils down to the tech chases from the Falcon, and the ability of the Fox to be able to shut down the Falcon's momentum. The Falcon is running all over the place. It can be really hard for the Fox. But, you know, Fox has really good moves to shut down Falcon, so it's pretty even right now. Scar was able to get out of the corner right there. Oh, uh, scratches his nose during the edge guard. Oh, my eyes actually suck. That's the worst part of getting old for me. <laughs> you have any glasses yet? Or? Dude, I'm... You don't even want to talk to me about my eyes. <laughs> you don't even want to... Anyways, Toph evens it up right there. Alright, that was, that was good. That was a good follow-up by Toph, but if, if uh, Bobby had teched it, the optimal thing to do right there as Fox is just to sit and wait for the Falcon, or any character, to tech, and then tech chase their tech with an up air. <clears throat> but Bobby didn't tech, so so just he did wait, he did wait, which was good. All right, got my jump back. We're chilling. Ooh. That's, that's right. like so. It's so hard to smash the eye. Got to smash the eye in front of Fox. Oh, wow! The first hit of the up air is in front of Fox. In the back, the second hit isn't behind him. So if you can get in front of him all the way, then you get far enough away from the second hit so it doesn't hit. Uh -oh. Scar with no shield. Got pushed to the corner. I noticed, I noticed, down. I noticed Bob is doing that recovery a lot. <laughs> wait, wait. <laughs> the only recovery. <laughs> Not on top. <laughs> As opposed just to like jump back knee. I feel like I'll just should. jump back knee. Jump back knee and I do that edge guard, I die. I feel like you yeah. just shouldn't be playing third player on Tony X. It's actually really shitty that they didn't figure out how to make the yellow like more yeah, obvious. Yeah, but I'm not, because this is pal. Yeah, yeah it's like third gold. That green, it's the green line. Alright, so, that's game one. Is NTSC Fox? I think I usually go back to the It's up to our, the host of this show, Scar. I'm going back. Okay. All right, I want to see Bobby. I have more of a plan here. I want to see Bobby keep him in the, in the corner a little bit more. Oh, here we go. Great start. Good wait. Nice. Ooh. Nice. Ooh. That's it, right there. Yeah. Put him in the corner and kept him. Hey, that was him actually there. what I was thinking. Like, I need my strategy to be any good. Corner him. I think Zach is so good at vocalizing. Like, strategy. He's doing his thing. I want to talk to you more about Dude, I'll be your Tapkins. We 
can, we can make the zero plus hero. I can show. be your tough zero, old baby. Zero. zero, two hero, zero plus hero. Oh, oh no. That's the auto shine. Oh, 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 that's frustrating. But, but Star needs to keep it together because it's only a knee away knowing Tope's DI. He's only Jesus. one knee away. Jesus! I <laughs> got, you, got your back, Bobby. Here we go. Okay, a little, little slow on the down air. I would have opted for the up air just just because the down air is a little hard to read. Oh, tries to go for the up air. There, nice. No jump. Nice. I didn't think that was going to be that jump. The get up. The long get up. Long color. Alright, let's see. Let's see who's gonna get this first hit. Oh, you see me wait? Yep, I did. I, I noticed it. I'd like to see Bobby do a little more dash dancing. Since right, when have I ever dashed dancing? Right, right now he's a little stiff. There we go. There, look at that. Oh no, he's dead. Oh, oh, oh I, I don't know Falcon. I thought he was dead for sure. That's the worst part. <laughs> what, oh, no. what did we talk about earlier? Like, you Dude, just... how come when I, I upbeat him and I die? <laughs> I love Fox. Oh my god. Uh, I love earning these edge guards. Just like. Can you, you, had, you, I had, had you had that one, Bobby. That, that was the shine spike. The shine feels spike so turned good. that one around. It feels so good. You know how Peaches you play must the first feel half of that when game. they get that down smash? They're like, like yes, hold, I yes, I earned. <laughs> that is how I feel right now. I love that. As long as Scar keeps to the game plan and remembers the cardinal rule. Cardinal rule is well. Cardinal rule applies to teams, but also applies to singles. Don't go off the stage. Unless you're absolutely sure that you got it. <clears throat> ah. Alright, alright. Oh! Ah, damn it. You played with our hearts. Alright, dog in the corner. Ah. Boom! I got so cold. Calculated. <laughs> Nice. Nice. There we go. Nice. Why not? Oh, arrive. Hi. Can I be a little bit? I don't know. That's fine, dude. Woo! Oh, oh, wait a minute! Look at this. Look, I've done that look, recovery. This is so what happens when you okay. don't get Shine Spike. This is what happens I mean, when you just don't adapt. go Let me just adapt stage. real quick. This is, this is what happens when you don't get Shine Spike at 0%. Oh, do it! Oh. Alright, Scar's got a regain center right here. There we go. Just like that. Nice. Look at him hold center. He doesn't need to move. He could be at center all game. A little, a little too early right there by Toe. Yeah. You know what I want. <laughs> Oops. Bobby could literally stand right next next to Wispy all game and win. <laughs> does not need to go past the side platforms at all. Playing it safe. I like it. I like it. Oh! Oh, that was actually so high. Did you see how fast that was? Did you see how fast that upper was? Yeah. I, I killed Mufasa right, empty floor. Time. Empty time. Uh oh. This is the. We, Scar and I played about 10 games in a row on FD. And I think he took collective of three stocks. But, but all that practice was for this, right here. Yes? Yes? Ooh! Just like that, Bobby. The brain star music, that's what gives me strength. <laughs> oh, wow. <clears throat> good punish, but I did. Text. Oh, good up Reaction air. up air. That was a great up air. Johnny Shields. 
Make sure it's soft. You want to make sure it's soft. <laughs> keep it up, keep it up. Oh, but down tilts. Down, down tilt was so underrated for box. Now, even with this deficit, Toe can still toe bring can it totally back. totally do it, because Toe gets me one time and I die. But... Ooh. Oh. Uh oh, Toe played for a raw up smash. Hmm. Uh, I think a knee would have been, been ideal right there. Only because, for the last, like, four scenarios like that, Bobby has opted for the, the back air or up air. And so, you know, just just guessing, you would guess that Toph would catch on and not DI up again. I've been reacting. It's all good. Okay, okay. Well, it's all good. Fair enough. Fair enough. Fair enough. But still, that's something to keep an eye out for players. You know, if you if you're doing a combo on a player and you you see they DI a certain way, mix it up. Mix it up. Wow. Good DI. Good DI. Good DI. Alright, as long as Bobby holds this center. This is still a pretty even game. Let's see, what, let's see if Star can clutch it. Nice. I like. I like the oh, jump back. No. Don't get in your own head, Bobby. Don't get in your own head. Do it. Ooh, yeah, up air. Got it. Up air. Yeah. Nice. Okay. We're keeping Close. it respectable. Don't get in your own head. Two, two. The, the two. That was a two zero. -oh. Gotta go back. Okay. Oh, okay. Here Can Scar do the three zero? -oh. I don't know. I feel. I feel like Toast a little warm now. He was really hot, and then he cooled off for a little bit, but now he's he's warmed back up. Scar pulling an shot and Zach did <laughs> <laughs> a three zero -oh comeback. Alright, Toph's not getting stuffed by those neutral airs anymore. That's what was kind of catching him in the first, the third and fourth game. Ooh, nice reaction. Nice. Nice! Oh my god, that was beautiful. Whoa. That was a classic old scar. Turn around, back air, reaction tech chase, the other way. Ooh, to get him. <gasps> Oh, 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 spacing! God, how did you learn how to do that? No one knows! <laughs> no one knows how that happened either. Uh, oh. Wow! S <laughs> bat oh, take it. S bat take it. That's fine though. Oh. Oh, this is this is too tight. I don't even know yeah, what's going on. Thanks, dude. No one wants to get this this next death. They're playing it super safe right here. Woo! Set that new player. Let's go, Toe. Bring it back, Toe. Baby, get loose. Get loose, baby. Let's see those dash dances. Got the shirt, baby. 
Let's, let's oh! see that tricky movement. Oh! Try to force it. Uh oh. Dance the around him. Dance Stop. around him. There we go. You gotta keep dancing. Keep dancing until Bobby throws something out. Oh, the strategy. Oh, spacing so good. His spacing is so good. Oh. His spacing is so good. Oh. This is amazing. Falcon punch. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I know where he's going too. <laughs> he's back. Oh, sorry. Some of the worst I've ever played. I thought you were gonna spank him. Sorry. Next up, Zach, Dewan, <laughs> Kevin. Oh, oh, you want to? I, I Scar, personally, baby. I personally apologize. Let's go. The year of Scar. <laughs> The reverse is that D my best stage worst box? Uh, you, I'll, I'll, is the matchup I'll, positive I'll show for the Falcon? People. I'll show the people. Is Scar? I'll show him too. Just the next Isaiah? Apparently not tonight. Apparently tonight is just not. Uh, lost no. my job. Lost the show. <laughs> Man. I think it's the I think it's the the zero and whatever hero it's show the now. Mic. It's I think, the mic. I think I think I think it's threw you it's, off. It's all over, man. It's the mic, dude. This is our microphone. I want everybody to see. Don't don't talk to that thing. That is when people get really mad. This is like the Tonka truck. You guys like to come close to it. We got it from McDonald's. All for the people. All for you. Call up Tonka to North every week. We'd be so. That is the ugly. What what happened earlier? There's a mango. And you know, it's very, very difficult to play your best when there's so much pressure being put on you <laughs> from the opposing player. I literally get more nervous fight facing Scar <laughs> on Monday or Wednesday nights than I do at tournaments because I know that if I lose at a tournament, I go to the loser's bracket, or maybe I'm done. And if I lose to Scar, I have to put up with this. Yeah, it's it's your terrible. Way. It is terrible. It is terrible. Another <laughs> two weeks of the earth properly revolving around it's its fine. <laughs> it's, it's fine in some ways because like all I have to do is just sit sit down with him in friendlies for half an hour. The scar and, and, and I shut him up show. really quick. But these best of fives are tough. Your edge guards were so strong. <laughs> I but missed every edge guard. You could not get me off stage. I had you up being <laughs> off stage so on the last. I had, I had my you literally, game well. I had you so literally well. up being my on the last game <laughs> was so strong. <laughs> that practice. That practice held down the middle. My tech chases? Yeah. Someone called me Wizro. He said literally Wizro. Did, did literally Wizro call you Wizro? Perhaps. Yeah. Oh my god. He's good. Were you listening to what Zach was saying and, adapt and incorporating it? In no. You weren't? Well, in fact, they uh, uh, get, get the other character to cut the tape. Yeah, we gotta cut the tape. Cut the tape. I, I actually gotta fuck. You gotta get going. It's late. I agree. Really have to go. I agree, Toph. Thank you all so much for tuning in. I'm going to stay here until I get tired and play Melee. <laughs> I'm down. I'm not doing anything. So we're going to switch to the Scar overlay. We're going to turn this off. And that I gonna, made. We're going to be back. I think Toph uh, is going to I'm, go I'm, back to his desk. I'm not going to. It's not my desk anymore. Think about. Uh, <laughs> That's right. We're going to go to S-Fat's desk. Think is about. S-Fat's desk? We're going to go to S-Fat's desk. Does Aatrox have two desks or does S-Fat have one in it? No, no. Tove is going to oh. think. You need another 300 years, Tove. Another 300 I years. Need about, I need about two minutes. And then if you want to watch some friendlies where I spank this guy nonstop, you know, feel free to stay tuned. <laughs> <laughs> like this? I mean, roughly, you need a ping pong paddle, minutes. baby. Roughly two minutes. Somebody take a picture. <laughs> this was worth every penny of the hundred and eighty-six dollars. <laughs> the next episode, two Mondays from now? Yeah. Right after HTC, baby. Wednesday. Oh, okay, Monday. Yeah. You gonna go to HTC Tope? No, no, yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna win that tournament. Not Unless either. you meet me in bracket. In which case is gonna be problems for you. If I play like this. I don't know. Please. Shoutouts to Atrioc, who got diamond in league very recently. Uh, the only, the only person me. who has talked about his his victory over some video game, arguably more than you. Um, because I yeah right. Oh, diamond. Yes. Diamond. If you play league, uh, you know what that means. <laughs> you know what it means. Well, thanks for having me on the show, guys. I Congratu appreciate it. It was a lot of fun. Congratulations to SFAT for holding down the Zero Plus Hero team mm -hmm. and showing Toph and I that we have lost to learn at teams.
However, we will be back. Congratulations to me for winning the most important set of the night. <laughs> I don't know, man. I lost my right, job. Guys, I'm gonna cut it. Okay. I'm gonna just cut it. Just cut it. Thank you again for tuning in. We'll see you in two weeks. Atrioc has to leave. Peace out. It's late. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for tuning in. You know, I didn't. I didn't make the scarring tope in slight emo because I thought for sure tope was this week. Oh! I even told Tobo, I was like, I'm not. <laughs>